Okay, what about his past? <laughs> you said Yale joined a gang back in the day? Know which one? Good talk. Hell, I don't know, John. This is New York City. There are more gangs than people. This will be a good one. Dunn wasn't black, but he allowed you and Bobby Yale to train here. Yeah, this was the first integrated gym in the city, I think. But not everyone liked that, hmm? You've seen the graffitis, right? If I get my hands on that bastard... Alright, you're good. I better let you get back to your drills. All right. Thanks for asking about my head injury. All right, let's do some more Skyrim shit. Or not. Check out the book first. Yeah, we got a book on poetry. And... A chess expander. And it's missing a few. Can I... do I do anything with this? No, it's just sitting there. Okay. Nothing really useful in there. Wait, hang on, I see one of those baseball cards. Take that. Can I follow those footprints again? Let's see where these lead. gone. Okay then. No going up there. Looks like a chest expander, doesn't it? Isn't that what? Hang on a minute. Hey, you know, call me. Hi, uh... Who are you? Oh, yeah. You bring my, bring my lunch? You... Hound... I mean, cat. Do you want anything in particular? Nothing in particular. Just something that fits in my mouth. Anything with cheese. Yeah, cheese. Lots of cheese. Okay. Good thing I'm going to a diner. On my way out of here again. Do I go this way? No, but let's walk off screen. Okay, let's try going this way. Can I just walk to it? No. Do I take car? I take car, don't I? I'd prefer a yellow Cadillac, but I can't complain. Why on earth would you want a yellow car? Hmm. 
Mary Purnell, the person who found Dunn's body, works a block away from the gym. I'm certain she can give me the kind of information that I need. Hey! Watch where you're going, you jerk! Okay. You looking for trouble, moron? Sorry. Really, I'm sorry. You better be, you Oh, bust. fuck you. New York, Jesus. Even the video games, the people are assholes. What have we got, game? Come on. And there you go. We'll miss you at Sam's Diner. Come back soon. Hello. Welcome oh to my Sam's god, what's wrong with what you? Can I get for you? Black Sad, Private Eye. I work for Sonia Dunn. I need to ask you some questions about Joe Dunn. Um, sure. But I'm working right now. <laughs> Maybe later? Uh, I need your help. Please. I need to find Bobby Yale as soon as possible. And I think you can help me. If I um, order something, will you? What can you tell me about Sonia Dunn? I barely know her, but she looks like a smart girl, poor thing. Uh, Joe? Let's talk a bit more about Joe Dunn. Can you tell me how you found Dunn's body? Well, I thought I was alone. I clean early in the morning before Mr. Dunn comes in. Oh, so you have keys to the gym? Yes, of course. There was paint on the floor, so I thought it'd be a busy morning. And then I saw him. Hanging there, like a baby mobile over a crib. Then I think I panicked. When I calmed down, I called the police and waited outside. Sorry. Why'd you panic? That's all I can say. Don't worry. But if you remember anything else, let me know. Uh, what kind of boss was he? What kind of boss was Joe Dunn? A good one. Always paid on time, never raised his voice. If I asked for the day off, he even cleaned the gym. How was Joe Dunn outside the gym? I wouldn't know. I only saw him at the gym or right there. That was his spot. Okay, well, what was he like I here? Think everyone liked him. Thanks, but I still don't get why he'd commit suicide. His wife died years ago. Maybe he never got over it. Yeah, I don't know. Or maybe he did. That was a long time Speculation ago. Speculation isn't gonna help here. I heard his relationship with his daughter wasn't ideal. Oh, really? Poor man, I don't have kids, but that has to be really hard. But I gotta talk about the money, I don't know about that. Any ideas where Bobby Yale could be? How how am I supposed to know? He's really there when I clean the gym. Bobby seems like a nice kid, but I I barely know him. Okay, what about Jake? What do you think about Jake Ostiambi? Who? Who's that? A big gorilla. Boxer, too. A friend of Joe Dunn's. Oh, yeah. I barely know him. I don't like how he looks at me. Okay, can you tell me more about this? Can I ask you about your job? Uh, which one? 
How long have you worked at the gym? It's been, what, four or five years? Although, I don't think I'll be able to set foot in there again. This must be really hard for you. I'm sorry. What about here? Tell me about your work here in the diner. Oh, it's wonderful. I love it. My boss. Oh, glad to hear that. Uh, do you work anywhere else? <laughs> Other than the diner and the gym, you don't work anywhere else, right? I wouldn't have the time, although I'm not sure I want to continue working at the gym. Yeah, stay away from now. It might be best to stay away from the gym, at least for a while, for your own well-being. In due time, things might change. Joey used to say the same thing. Maybe. I don't know. Thanks. Uh, may I have a hamburger, please? Can I have a hamburger, please? Oh, sure. Regular cheese. cheese? I think I'll get the cheeseburger. Mm-hmm. It's weird that they... You want fries? A drink? No, that's it. Okay. Is that for here or to go, then? To go, please. Mm -hmm. It's weird Why that they don't have tails. Go, <laughs> Cats throws okay. me off a bit. The fuck is happening? What? They look puffy. Oh, I wonder why. Tired. Sleepless nights, hectic days, or has she been crying? Perhaps all of the above. The fuck is this? That's really creepy. Okay. Her handwriting is nice and neat. I missed one. What was the point of that? I felt like a unnecessary step. Your burger is ready. Here you go, buddy. Can you feed a goat a hamburger? Alright, I'll let you enjoy your meal. Four people used the back door that very same night. What? Well, I might be blind as a bat, but as you can certainly see, I have two wonderfully functional ears. <laughs> Thank you very much for remembering the cheese, by the way. <laughs> Four people used the back door two days ago? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, the first person. Who was the first person to use the back door? Someone big. Unlocked the door, stepped inside, <laughs> then came right back out. Okay, second person. Who was the second person to use the back door? man just a few minutes after the first person he came back out muttering ungrateful bastard then he threw something in the trash and walked back in oh no wait before that 
He gave me a coin. A coin? I mean, do I look like I need spare change, huh? I mean, I'm staying at the Million Star Hotel, for God's sake. <laughs> you need a drink, buddy? I could have gotten you a drink. Who was the third person to use the back door? Judging by the quiet footsteps, I'd say it was someone small. I'd say it was about 30 minutes after the second person came out. Whoever it was threw something in the trash and stood in front of me for a moment. Then I heard a click. And finally, I heard trailing laughter in that direction. Who was the fourth person to use the back door? Someone big. I recall heavy breathing. The person left in a hurry, running in that direction. <coughs> hey, what about that? There's a chest expander in your cart. A what expander? A thingamajig with three springs. Oh, the thingamajig with springs. Oh, I, I got it from the trash back there. The hell did you get over there? Could he have been a train conductor? Maybe. Explain the uh, lack of legs. I wonder what it's like to be blind. Would I cope? Speaking of which. You know it's going to be one of them. Blind and legless. How does he get by? Ah. Looks like someone used it as a punching ball. Okay, that's everything. Where did you get that paint can? In the trash can in the back. A paint can and a thingamajig with springs. What a night. This might be rude, but I'm going to ask it anyways. You were acting a bit strange before, but now you seem fine. Why is that? Hey, you got great vision, sense of smell, and hearing. Why is that? Well, I'm a cat. Well, I'm a goat. Okay, thank you. That's all for now. Thanks. New deduction. Okay, uh, this is something new. Okay, how about that? There we go. Well, I know this much. The chest expander in the trash belongs to Yale. We'll go get it. Get it to the phone. Hang on. No. Actually, hang on. <laughs> 